Hi mamas and welcome to the Mama Makeup Corner, which is literally in my bedroom corner. Today, I look crazy. I look absolutely crazy. I was testing out some new blushes that I got and I always do like a liquid and powder blush combo and I love this color, but I am not used to this shade. I've never worn shades like this. It's the Juvia's Place, the new liquid blush in the shade Sweet Berries and the new L'Oreal Infallible 24 Fresh Wear Blush in the shade Legendary Berry. And I just thought this combo is perfect. You know, I love doing a liquid blush and then a powder blush over top. I just, boom. But it looks a little crazy and I just gotta figure it out. Just gotta figure it out. As if it's like my first time ever doing makeup. It's great. And my lip liner is also a little crazy today too. I was testing out this Snow White. Um, I was testing out the Snow White Evil Queen lip kit. And these are all very, very fall shades, but I just felt like going for it. And I was in such a hurry that the lines are kind of all over the place. So forgive me if they look crazy. I'm crazy and it's gonna be okay. Today we're gonna talk about a project pan. Specifically, pan a palette in a year. I saw, I can't remember her name. If I can remember her name, I will just put it in my description box below. But she did like pan in every palette and a pan over a year and it's just Steph did a pan in a year or something like that. Like just working through a palette. And I thought I want to do that. I have so many palettes and some old palettes that I haven't gotten to. And while I've got my other project pans that will come up later, I want to talk about this one now. And the palette I chose for this year starting in May, so I've already used it twice, is the Smashbox. Smashbox. I put stickers on the back of all of my palettes so I can write notes and I've literally never even written on this one. And it's probably one of my oldest palettes. It looks like this. If any of you can tell me what palette this is, like the name of it, that'd be great. It's just like an all matte, all neutrals. One side is all more tans and browns and the other side is more purpley, cool tone leaning. One's warm, one's cool. I don't know. I just thought this is perfect for everyday use. I could do a ton with this palette. I can see all sorts of looks. My goal this time around for this palette is to hit pan in every single uh, pan in here. Every single shade needs a pan in it. That's my goal. So next year in May, May 1st, will be the deadline. I can't give you shade names. I can't give you any shade names, but these are all the shades right here. We have our warm side and our cool tone side. There's a lot of options here as far as an all over lid shade, neutral shades, things like this can be eyeliner. This black one and this dark brown one. I'm excited to use those. Lots of all over the lid shades, lots of cut crease options here. So we're gonna give it a go. This is what it looks like now. barely used on any of them. It's been barely used, so none of these shades look like anything has happened. You can kind of tell, no, you really can barely tell that anything has been done with any of these shades, but I've got plans. I can do brows, I can do all over lids, I can do creases, I can do eyeliners, all smoky looks, all sorts of things. So I'm really excited to use this palette this year. If you want to see what it looks like every month, just tune in. I don't know. I'll update you when I update you, I guess. But it will be at least once a month. Also, if you like this eye look, don't forget to view all of my short videos. Short content is easier for me to make. I mess up speaking a lot. I'm not very eloquent in any shape or form. So speaking, to, speaking in a video can be kind of <coughs> nerve wracking. And I don't get nervous per se, like I'm alone in here. And I don't care if my husband or my kids hear me because they don't know what's going on. But the short content is a lot easier for me to film. I'm filming at 4 a.m. most days and my husband, is, like our bed is right here. And my husband's still asleep and our dogs are sleeping. And I, I feel like if I'm over here talking, I'm gonna bug them too, like wake them up. And I don't wanna do that. So the short form content is easier for me to do. But if you like this eye look, go check out my shorts. I've got tons of nails on there. I recently decided to quit a certain nail company but I still got tons of nail content. Go check out my shorts if you wanna see any of that. Also, hold up. 
if you like my channel, click subscribe, like this video, go tell a friend, go tell your neighbor, unless your neighbor's a douche, then don't tell your neighbor. Uh, go to TikTok, go to Instagram, go to Facebook, my VIP group. In my VIP group, I usually just talk about nails, but lately I'm gonna switch things up to all sorts of things. At like makeup, skincare, spa nights, the works, and it's gonna be a blast. So join me in the Mama Makeup Corner anytime you want. Bye, mamas! <laughs>